The floater was invented by a man by the name of Niceman. Many NBA superstars quickly adopted this style of shot into their technique. As these players exhibit the best way to execute the shot known as the floater, the origin of this shot did not start within the professional scene. Today we explore where the floater was born and how it became so popular. Now we will be listening to some real life testimonies of people who had the floater used against them. When I saw the shot, I knew it was revolutionary. I had nightmares about it for weeks. What's a floater? The next testimony is from somebody who had their life destroyed by an Iceman's floater, that he refused to have his face shown on this documentary. Do you still play basketball to this day? No. I've been in therapy for five months. The reason why it kind of came up is because I couldn't find a cross between shooting a three and also laying up. And then when I invented this, it was kind of like a mix between the two. And when I created the shot, I knew it was just going to be phenomenal. The floater was really an underground shot. Like this didn't develop in the pro scene. These were just like, you know, from pickup games with other people. And uh, it eventually started here and then it made its way into the professional scene later. The floater is a shot that changed the game of basketball forever. This is now the most renowned shot in the game. Not many people are aware of where this shot was created and it is unlikely that nice men will ever get the recognition that is due. Still don't know what a floater is. 